The school is back in session. Many kids are finding themselves back at home feeling ill. News Force Will Polston joins us live in studio. Now, Will, what are schools seeing as they welcome students back? Well, Kinsley, a lot of different illnesses are going around as kids are all coming back together, specifically in Geneva County. They've noticed an early reappearance of COVID in the classroom. It's been less than two weeks since Geneva County schools started back, and already they've had nearly 20 reported cases of COVID among students and staff. When school starts back, you are going to see an increase in illness because, you know, the students are together. They've been kind of separated and at home for the summer. So you are going to see a rise in illnesses of all types. While getting your child to school is important, Tyndall says that their health is the priority. The staff at Geneva County Schools urge parents to keep their kids at home if they show any symptoms. If you are sick or if you think you're sick, then you don't need to come to school or work. You need to stay home and call your physician um, and just be smart about things like that. You know, we don't want to get other people sick. Even if your child is getting sick more often early in the year, it may not be a reason to stress. Tyndall says that younger students tend to get sick more often, especially being around other kids for the first time. Parents, especially of younger children like pre-K and kindergarten, they need to keep in mind that those students are building their immunity. So they are going to be sick more often. It's not an indication that it's a problem with your child or they're not healthy. Um, that's normal. As we get older, we build that immunity as we're exposed to more things. The Geneva County Board of Education policy requires parents to keep their children at home until they are fever free for 24 hours without taking a fever reducing medicine. Kinsley. Well, Polston, thank you for that report.